the person that we're talking about is nothing, no one other. Yes. And juvenile, ladies and gentlemen, give my house. man the every bump on your face. My face hurts. <laughs> uh, you know, I've always said that I'm I'm in debt. You're the reasons why. Crazy. So. Mm. Uh, yes, mm, likewise. Um, thank you, sir. <laughs> All the way to Florida. Yeah, uh, that's amazing. Ben Washer walked up and sh put his hand out in the lobby. We just need you to say that this is where you came from. I've been wanting to watch rated R movies. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah. So, <laughs> shoot. Yeah. Uh, you know, and and man. It's okay. an honor. I'm glad I'm here. Yeah, we glad. Put this mug up on a, like in a PowerPoint presentation. Here are the reasons why I'm crazy. And 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 and, 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 and all the brilliance of crazy. Welcome, my guy, crazy. <laughs> to the goat that sits on on the porch outside, probably smoking a black and mild. Crazy. God didn't give me the brain cells to figure that out. <laughs> <laughs> but all I'm saying is that is the truth. It is the truth. I'm talking about if you get your Lexum Bibles dictionary, you look up one one six in that mug. Man. It's gonna be a picture of Lecrae there yes. with your Bible because you don't read it enough. That's right. So how does Lecrae read your Bible more than you read your Bible? <laughs> you don't really mean that, do you? <laughs> but. And if you have acne, I do. Yes. Oh. Yes. And 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 and, and not not to mention boom, that you can boom, think boom. of race boom boom. <laughs> One of those mental issues has to be yes. Lecrae. Lecrae. Absolutely. <sighs> this is that oh was a hey, bro. <laughs> Crazy. Y'all were made for this. <laughs> So Rich, hopefully there's man. something else left to talk I about. Know. So a deconstruction took place where I really did not think that there was a God, but I didn't need to believe in Jesus. He believed in me. God did. <laughs> me in. Me in. But I didn't need to believe in Jesus. He believed in me. God did. <laughs> so I hope you all had a good laugh. Some good, clean Christian humor. But now it's time to get serious. Because I don't know if you caught it, but it was something that Crazy said that is extremely dangerous. See, the English language is very delicate. If you just change one single word around, you could change the entire meaning of what you're trying to say. This is what Lecrae said, I didn't need to believe in Jesus. He believed in me. And this is what he should have said. I needed to believe in Jesus. He didn't need to believe in me. God don't need to believe in anything. He's omniscient. He knows everything. What does he need to believe in? Who does he need to believe in? He don't need to believe in you. He doesn't need to believe in me. He knows it all. Crazy is the opposite day because the exact opposite of what you said is true. And that is an issue. So I'm not going to pretend to assume the context that Lecrae was using. All I can go by is a statement that he said. And the wording in the statement that he said is dead wrong. Do you know how much times it says in the Bible to believe in Jesus? John 3, 16. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever believes in him should not perish but have eternal life. Acts 16, 31. John 5, 24. John 6, 47. Romans 10, 9. John 8, 24. John 3, 36. John 6, 35. And the list goes on. You should never say as a Christian, I didn't need to believe in Jesus. Why? Because there's never a time where somebody doesn't need to believe in Jesus. I'm not gonna go to my past self and be like, hey, past self, you know what? You don't need to believe in Jesus. He's just gonna believe in you. <laughs> I would be leading my past self to hell. If I saw my past self, I'd be like, you, my friend, need to believe in Jesus. You do. You do. If you want to go to hell, then hey, you can do what you want. You don't need to believe in Jesus. But if you don't want to go to hell, and you want to be with God, and you want to go to heaven, and you want to have eternal life, well, you need to believe in Jesus. God don't need to believe in you. That sounds all good and warm and fuzzy. You know, God just believes in me. Hmm. He just believes in me. But he doesn't. So I'm a Christian. I'm supposed to have some grace. So Lecrae, I'm asking that you would retract that statement. If you see this video, if you don't see it, I don't know, but if you see it, please retract the statement. Take it back, clear it up. Because as a public figure in the Christian community, I'm not saying you should be a Christian leader, but people look up to you as a Christian leader. So you have a responsibility to really watch what you say. Because if somebody actually believes in that, that would lead them to hell. I don't need to believe in Jesus, God's just gonna believe in me. So now you're putting the responsibility on God to believe when it's 
is uh, that's what we're supposed to do. We are supposed to believe in Jesus. God don't need to believe in anybody or nothing. Lecrae, do you know that? Do you know that God's omniscient? Do you know what omniscience is? Do you know he's all knowing? Because from what you said, look, I'm gonna give you the benefit of the doubt that you misspoke. Please clear it up, please. Lecrae, you just gotta be really careful when you're talking about anything that's associated with God in the Bible. Crazy.